Hey guys, so it is December, which means it's time to start shopping for people for Christmas. So I personally love watching these videos, but this will be just a compilation of book recommendations to buy for people based on their likes. I have to talk about a book that I would pretty much recommend to anybody, but specifically anyone who really enjoys sci-fi. 100% I would recommend Dark Matter by Blake Crouch. There hasn't been a person I've recommended this book to that hasn't absolutely loved it. So I for sure would recommend this book. Honestly, even someone who likes fantasy, I would even risk getting this book for them. I mean, I don't know. I feel like everybody could like Dark Matter. It's just universally a really great book, but definitely geared towards those who like sci-fi types of stories. They will love it. Let's talk about a romance novel next. I decided to go with one of the king's leaders of romance, Nicholas Sparks, and this is a book that I read a couple years ago. It's called The Longest Ride and I think it became a movie, although I haven't seen the movie. But this is like the last Nicholas Sparks book that I read that I enjoyed. So I really liked this story because it had two different stories in it. There was a modern day story and then there was the story of this man and his wife and their romance and their marriage and it's just so sink and sweet. I really, really, really loved this book. I honestly wish the whole book was just this older man talking about his his life with his wife. It's so beautiful. I love it. So yes, that is a great romance novel. I would recommend it if you have someone in your life who likes romance. For fantasy, I'm actually going to recommend, it's just young adult fantasy, I should specify because I haven't read enough adult fantasy to really give a recommendation. But this is a series I read last summer, not this summer, like the summer before, and fell completely in love with it. It really kind of kick-started me back into reading more, and that's the Winner's Kiss trilogy. Oh my word, I mean, you could just get your friend, brother, sister, whoever likes fantasy the first novel, or you can just go ahead and be really nice and get them the box set. It's just three books, they're all out. They are wonderful. I love these books. I found them to be suspenseful, completely entertaining. There's tons of political intrigue, just a really good book. And the thing is, it's, I think it's classified as fantasy, but there's no magic in this book. It's more just like a, a parallel universe kind of place where there, it is in America, there's just these kingdoms, but there's no magic in these kingdoms. So it's a fantasy, but kind of not a fantasy at the same time. I don't really know what it would be classified as. Anyways, I'd recommend it for anyone who really likes fantasy novels though. For historical fiction, I wanna recommend to you The Lilac Girls. If you have anyone who loves historical fiction, this book is a must. It's a World War II fiction story following three different females and three different perspectives during World War II. I don't think you could go wrong giving this book as a gift. I think it could be loved by pretty much anyone who's a lover of historical fiction. And I really like how this book is rooted in reality too. The author at the end of the book does talk about the characters and how all of her characters are based on real people, which I think added a really great element to the story. So I 100% would recommend this for a lover of historical fiction. Now I'm gonna recommend a mystery book for all you mystery lovers out there, friends who love mystery, parents who love mysteries. I have not read too much mystery. It's a genre that I'm getting into that I really like, but I still haven't read too many books. But the one series that stands out to me as just being phenomenal is the Cuckoo's Calling series, the Cormoran Strike series by JK Rowling slash Robert Galbraith. I've talked about these books a lot and I talk about them a lot because I think people should read these books because they're great. I mean, the Cuckoo's Calling wasn't my favorite book, but as the series goes on, these books just get better and better and better, and it's just so good when that happens. Um, yeah, still waiting desperately for that fourth book. These are great books. I think they would make a great gift. I have to have another fantasy recommendation. It's a subcategory of fantasy. If you have someone who likes fantasy retellings, like fairy tale retellings, I would highly recommend Hunted by Megan Spooner. I read this book in the summer going into fall, and I really wish I had read it in the winter. It is such a good winter story because it takes place in winter. It's a Beauty and the Beast retelling. So if you know anyone who likes Disney retellings, Beauty and the Beast, give them Hunted. They will love you. It's a good book. Really quick to read and I love how this Beauty and the Beast story wasn't 
really good about the romance which was nice it was a really good change i hadn't read a retelling like this before and i really enjoyed it so definitely would recommend it also just has a really beautiful cover i love it i think it's so stunning and a really good book to read in the winter time so give this to somebody my final recommendation is kind of goes with my first column but it's sci-fi slash fantasy combined slash historical fiction so it kind of gets its own little category if you know anyone who is interested in any of those topics they probably will be interested in 11 22 63 by stephen king and now i definitely will be talking about this book in my yearly wrap-up because it's one of my favorite books that i read in 2017. this book is wonderful and it's so cool how it's a combination of so many different genres so that's why i feel like this would be such a good book to give to someone our main character goes to the past back to the past whatever to try to stop the assassination of jfk so you got some really cool elements going on there's also a wonderful romance in this story i just this book is so good and it's just a book that i feel like could really be universally loved by so many which is why i wanted to end this video with talking about 11 22 63. so those are all the books that i would recommend in general i've seen really good reviews for these books so i know it's not just me who really likes them but i hope this guide was helpful for you if you're trying to find the perfect book for someone you love anyway thank you so much for watching and happy reading.